a two meter tall basketball player is standing on the floor uh, 10 meter from the basket as shown over here so this is 10 meters and the height of the basketball player is two meters and where he has to basket is 3.05 meters from uh, the distance from his legs uh, he throws the basketball at an angle of 40 degree and we need to find the minimum speed so that the ball goes right through the loop to the hoop so let's uh, analyze the motion in two parts one is the horizontal uh, motion so in the horizontal let's first uh, assume that the velocity with which he throws is v naught so the horizontal component is going to be v naught cos of 40 degrees so the vertical component is going to be v naught sine of 40 degree in the horizontal side we do not have any acceleration and as the time is simply distance over speed so what is the horizontal distance that's 10 and what is the horizontal speed that's v naught cos of 40 degrees let's call it equation one now let's analyze the vertical motion uh, since there is an acceleration due to gravity which is 9.8 meter per second acting meter per second square acting down so we're going to use the second equation of motion here that the displacement s is equal to v initial times t plus half a t square let's take upside direction as positive so the displacement will be from this point to the hoop which is nothing but 3.05 minus 2 because that is this distance right so the displacement is going to be 3.05 minus 2 v initial is uh, v naught sine theta so that is v naught sine theta theta is 40 time is 10 over v naught cosine theta v 10 over v naught uh, uh, cosine of 40 degree plus half of now acceleration due to gravity is downward and we have taken upward direction as positive so that's take that should be taken as a negative 9.8 and then t square is again 10 over v naught cos of 40 degree uh, whole square so 3.005 minus 2 is 1.05 uh, v naught and v naught is cancelled sine over cos is 10 so we are left with tan times 10 40 degree minus 4.9 times this is going to be 100 over v naught square cos square 40 degrees and the only variable here is v naught which is something which we have to find so that's where the calculator comes in so if we use the calculator the answer uh, which we will be having is so the value of uh, uh, v naught from here uh, comes out as 10.67 and the unit is meter per second so this will be the minimum velocity with which it should be thrown so that it passes just passes through the hoop and uh, it baskets in the ball this is the final answer thank you